morning guys it's july 27 2024 it's 8 10 in the morning and it's cooler the sun didn't shine yet and then let's see the the weather here it's only less than 70 so i decided to work today <laughs> continue the in the garden still i'm cleaning up the garden this is like a summer rebumping cleaning all right, so these are the plants. I gathered all the plants that I bought way back and they need to be repotted. It's chaotic here, <laughs> chaotic here, chaos, chaos. And that's the way to clean the garden. Mess here and then clean up. All right, so these are the plants that I'm gonna repot. This is the sp spin top red starburst. So I've got the two. So I'm just gonna clean up, take out the dead flowers. And then this is a uh, hibiscus. I have two hibiscus, it's here. Hibiscus. And then this one is marginata, marginata. So, and this one is plumeria. The plumeria needs to be repotted as well, so it's so it will grow. Right, guys. So the soil is here now. I put some, and you will see it's chunky with nutrients. All right, so. Put this this is plumeria 1998 i've got it in i believe home depot you see the the soil is too much uh perlite because perlite is the best You see those boxes around there? <laughs> I'm gonna use it in treating some of the soil in the garden. There, finally, look at that. There, see that? Wow, look at the roots. I'm so fascinated with the roots because the roots is the main reason that's why. The roots is good, healthy, plants is healthy okay uh, you want to add the plumeria in your garden do it now on summer because this is their moment in winter they're gonna be uh, dormant So this is golden aeonymus or aure aurea marginatus. All right, so this is a beautiful shrub when it grows long.
right guys before I will repot this off camera I want to show you what will I do to the to the dried or dead flowers and it's blooming more so this plant is like I said it's a spin top red starburst so I will sanitize my scissor sanitize the scissor make sure that the you know, there's no bugs or dirt on the scissor so to, to for the benefits of the plants to grow very well and healthy so I'm gonna take trim off all these uh, leaves I mean the, the flowers wherever is the not green trim that part then they will grow back and produce more flowers newcomers right and then we'll go with this with this uh, this is uh, hibiscus so hibiscus see it, it, she has flowers there but and they love uh, the soil moist all right so this one is good there's nothing yellow or what flowers <laughs> yeah yellow yellow leaves I mean and the flowers are all good let's see okay that's it so I'm not gonna spray them all because it's too hot now and I'll just repot this pour off camera and I'll give you the outcome of today's gardening alright guys all the the flowers plants are repotted and All right, guys, I'm almost done here. And thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for your support, your friendship. And hope that you learned something in the proper way of preparing. I have a lot of care tips. And always remember, God bless you. God loves you. Jonah loves you. And here's the rebuild.